Hi, everybody. I'm Sue Serio from Fox 29's Good Day Philadelphia. This is my dog, Rufus. We're here in my backyard where I've been doing my broadcasts since the end of March. It's a global pandemic, and we've all had to do whatever we can to get the job done. And that's why we are all here. We are very, very happy to welcome you to the first ever Pup Rally. Yay! This is kicking off the Fox Chase Cancer Center's annual pause for the cause. I was honored to serve as the pause MC last year. Rufus and I had such a great time. And although we are not together in person, there is so much fun ahead throughout the entire month. And Rufus and I are happy to be a part of it, right? Right. I think he sees a bird somewhere. Anyway, how does a virtual pause work? And what's involved? Well, first of all, we're still raising money for the Fox Chase Cancer Center and their important research. Even though it is a pandemic, cancer care has not stopped and your support is more important than ever. And guess what's new this year? Cats. Yes, in our virtual world, we can welcome your cats and their owners to participate this year. So there's no need to track your activity, whether you're walking your dog, napping with your cat, enjoying a backyard picnic on the deck like we are. Just pay your registration fee and then the sky is the limit. Now the month will consist of different themes every week. Don't miss Cat's Meow Week. Oh boy, show us your cats in their favorite spots and sunbeams. And after that, it is Dog Domain Week. That's for you, Rufus. Share photos of you and your dogs on walks, in the yard, playing fetch, or doing what Rufus does so well, and that is sleeping. Finally, we'll close out the month-long celebration with the Paws Spooktacular. Send in photos of your pets in their Halloween best and enter to win the costume contest. You can send your entries to paws at fccc.edu. Each week, make sure to share your photos on the Paws Facebook event page as well as your own social media channels and make sure to use this hashtag, Paws for the Cause. That's P-A-W-S for the Cause. Also new this year, the competition is on. Cats versus dogs, woof versus meow. See who will win in our Paws Pet Challenge and who will raise the most money for the Fox Chase Cancer Center. When you register, you will be asked whether your pet is a dog or a cat. Throughout the month, we'll be tracking each group's fundraising progress and you can reach out to your friends, to your family. They can make a donation if they can't participate and you might win the contest along with your pet, right? Although we're all apart this year, you know we're all in this together. Thank you in advance for your support of the Fox Chase Cancer Center. Hello everyone, I'm Julia Gopalu. Chair of Pause for the Cause 2020, presented by Fox Chase Cancer Center's Board of Associates and our title sponsor, West Pharmaceutical Services. And this is our virtual pup rally. Woohoo! I'm here with my special friend, Rafa Goplerud. This handsome guy was rescued by us eight years ago and is a beloved member of our family. You may remember him from previous Pause for the Cause. He's usually the poorly behaved dog at the event and also on television when we are promoting it. However, we like to think that his unruly behavior is part of his charm. This is our 21st year for Pause for the Cause. So why are we going virtual this year? Well, as you know, we're in the midst of a COVID-19 pandemic. And because we have between 400 and 500 participants crowded together on our campus every year, for a one mile dog walk to raise funds for cancer research, we felt that it would be in the best interests of our patients, survivors, and all of our other participants. There are lots of reasons why our virtual pause for the cause is going to be wildly successful. First of all, history. Remember a few years ago, it was torrential rain and high winds the morning of our event. It was because Hurricane Matthew had just hit the coast in the aftermath was hitting the Philadelphia area. So what did we do? We went undercover. We went to our covered parking garage and held an event, surrounded by pouring rain, but we did great. Lots of folks, lots of money raised, lots of fun. This year, we have a great opportunity. First of all, 
Not only can you walk your dog, but we have a category for cats. You can play with your cat. You can hold your cat. You can watch your cat eat. You can watch your cat nap. You can nap with your cat. Lots of options there. In addition, you can walk your dog as far as you want, or you can just walk around the block. It's completely up to you. As long as you register for the event, every dollar counts. And everyone across the world can actually participate in this. Another really fun thing is our raffle baskets. Like this one. Our fantastic raffle baskets are going to be available, but we'll be selling them online. In addition to being chair for Paws for the Cause, I have the privilege of serving as president of the Fox Chase Cancer Center Board of Associates. The Board of Associates was created in 1965 to raise funds for Fox Chase Cancer Center dedicated to cancer prevention, research, and treatment. And we raise money for Fox Chase through activities and events all year round. To date, our organization has raised more than $26 million for cancer research. Keep it going, everyone. We'd love to have some new members. So if you're interested, let us know. People ask me why I am involved with Paws for the Cause. Let me share two stories with you. The first reason is very personal. My husband was diagnosed with prostate cancer about 12 years ago. His experience at Fox Chase Cancer Center was incredible. From the doctors to the nurses, to all the support they gave to him, me, and our family. I can never repay that. And that's the reason why I'm so passionate about Paws for the Cause and about raising funds for Fox Chase Cancer Center. I'd like to share another story with you about someone I met while at a dinner at Fox Chase Cancer Center. I just happened to randomly sit at a table. I didn't know anyone there. And I happened to be chatting with a nice lady who was sitting next to me. She told me that she was a stage four breast cancer patient, but that she had recently taken part in a clinical trial that had really changed her life. She felt so much better. She actually was planning a trip to Italy with her daughter. They were going to create some memories and she was enjoying her life every moment. The reason this is important is because she happened to tell me the doctor who was conducting the trial and the name of the trial. And I suddenly realized that two years earlier, we had designated funds from Paws for the Cause to that particular doctor for that particular trial. This just shows that every dollar matters and everything you do for an event like Paws for the Cause matters. It matters to us and it matters to the people we love and it matters to people we may not even know. COVID is with us now but COVID eventually will go away. Cancer is here for the long haul. Let's do everything we can to raise funds for cancer research, prevention, and treatment. We also have a trip down memory lane for you. Since we can't be together in person this year, we wanted to show you some slides from Pause from the Past to give you a sense for those of you who don't know what it's like to have 500 people and their pets crowded together in front of the Cancer Center parking lot, to have a great morning walking the dog, looking at raffle baskets, and participating in contests. Enjoy the show. Good evening, everyone. I'm Dr. David Chen. I'm currently the Associate Chief Academic Officer at Fox Chase Cancer Center, where I joined the Department of Surgery in 2004 as a newly minted urologic cancer surgeon. Over the last 16 years, I've witnessed firsthand the tremendous growth and expansion of the Cancer Center. One constant throughout my time at Fox Chase has been the steady focus and attention to the core mission of the institution to prevail over cancer. 
and Fox Chase has always maintained a patient and family-centered perspective at the forefront, and it shows in all the work that goes on to address cancer. One example of the collaborative spirit at Fox Chase is the annual Pause for the Cause event, and my family and I have participated with our dogs in this fundraiser multiple times, and so I am thrilled to be involved in this year's Pause for the Cause event as the Physician Ambassador. This will be the 21st annual Pause for the Cause event, and like many things affected by COVID, it will be different. And although it won't be possible to be live and in person, we are excited about the changes that are planned. While we are not physically together, I know that I share your dedication and commitment to this amazing institution, and my family and I look forward to joining all of you over the next month from home and around our neighborhood as we support such a worthy cause. Working at Fox Chase Cancer Center over the last 16 years, I am inspired every day in the interactions I have with my patients, their families and caregivers, and with my wonderful colleagues. So on behalf of the Fox Chase Cancer Center faculty, thank you for being part of this amazing effort. So be sure to check out the Pause for the Cause website to learn all of the details as this event goes virtual. While there, you can print out your own race bib and take a moment to share who you are supporting this year. Take a selfie with you and your family and your pet and post it on Facebook and other social media, adding the hashtag pause for the cause. Thank you for your commitment to Fox Chase Cancer Center and this year's pause for the cause, helping the patients that we are so privileged to serve. Hello, my name is Catrice Graham and I am a proud Fox Chase breast cancer survivor and honored to be this year's Paul's Patient Ambassador. I found that Fox Chase was indeed the place for me. From the time I dropped my paperwork off with a nurse coordinator to the genuine smiles, hugs, compassion, understanding, and always able to receive contact or return calls from my doctors, I knew that my journey was going to be successful at Fox Chase. When you are battling something serious, no matter what it is, compassion and understanding goes a long way and it definitely helps through your program. I've said it before and I'll say it again. Fox Chase is extraordinary. By being a Paul's ambassador, I am so humbled because I get to continue to spread the word about Fox Chase. Not only does Fox Chase help people battle cancer or give you other options to help extend your life, Fox Chase is constantly around the clock, a research center. They're always looking for ways to try to help beat cancer or let's just be real, eradicate it. Let's find a cure, but the only way to do so or to keep coming up with options is to donate. We donate to all other things and all other charities and they are important too. But if you think about five people, the first five people that you can think of, one of five of them will be diagnosed with some kind of cancer or illness. And in order for institutions, Fox Chase in particular, to continue to provide extraordinary service wonderful service, and healing people like myself. They need donations. Please spread the word. Please, let's continue to try to save lives through Fox Chase. Please, let's have some compassion and continue to be extraordinary. Fox Chase is a wonderful place. Anyone who knows, knows me knows my battle, and I'm still here today. And I'm here healthy, still almost three years cancer free. The doctors are phenomenal. Please support. We are Fox Chase strong. It is an extraordinary place. Thank you.
Good evening, everybody. Welcome to the strangest year in the world's history. Welcome to our annual Pause for the Cause. This is my seventh version of this, and certainly we are doing it differently today than we've ever done it before. This is Quinn and Casey, our two young Irish setters. Clancy's at age 13, a little bit old for the excitement, so he's staying in the house. We want to thank everybody for joining us tonight. We want to thank especially our sponsors, West Pharmaceuticals. We want to thank the Board of Associates, led by Julia, who has been involved with this for many, many years and always does a great job. We want to thank David Chen, who is our ambassador. And finally, we want to thank our patient advocate, Catrice, for all of her efforts on this. You can see the dogs are walking and enjoying this. We hope you will join us throughout the month in this uh, abnormal celebration of Pause for the Cause. And maybe next year we'll all be back together walking around Fox Chase. Thanks for all your support and have a great day. Hi, I'm Cindy Kelleher and this is Chloe. I've worked at Fox Chase for a little over 20 years, and Chloe has been a therapy dog for two and a half years. A lot has changed with the COVID-19 pandemic. Chloe and I have had to stop visiting in person, and we really miss seeing all the patients and their families and the staff at Fox Chase. We've all had to get creative and find some new ways to do things, from some of Chloe's favorite activities to pause for the cause going virtual. While we're certainly going to miss the grand chaos that is Pause for the Cause in person, Chloe and I are still here to participate and support the cause because the one thing that really hasn't changed in this pandemic is cancer. Chloe and I experienced this firsthand. She was diagnosed with sarcoma at the beginning of the pandemic and needed surgery just as everything was closing down. It was a very scary time, but luckily her vet was able to care for her her surgery went well, she's fully recovered, and she has a low chance of recurrence. But it's obviously important that not just dogs, but people get high quality cancer care during the pandemic and always, which is what we do at Fox Chase. And to help support that cause by providing funding for research, Pause for the Cause is going virtual, but it's going to be going strong this year, just like usual. Cancer's not taking a break for this pandemic so we can either. Please join Chloe and I in supporting Pause for the Cause 2020 to help raise money for research at Fox Chase Cancer Center. Thanks. We have been blessed with a great number of sponsors this year for the 21st annual Pause for the Cause. But I wanted to sh give a shout out to just a few of them. First of all, our title sponsor, West Pharmaceutical Services, our champion sponsor, American Heritage Credit Union, and our other sponsors, Janet and Dr. Paula Engstrom, and member of Corinne Roxby, and Metropolitan Veterinary Associates. Thanks so much to our sponsors for helping us in a difficult time go virtual with Pause for the Cause. We appreciate your loyal support. Good evening. Wes has a long relationship with Fox Chase, going back to Herman O. West. Every year since 2002, team members hold a fundraiser for a different department at Fox Chase. Over the years, Wes and its employees have donated over $10 million to this amazing institution. We are so pleased to continue our support of Fox Chase. Imagine a financial institution that you own. What does that look like? Would it provide tens of thousands of free ATMs? Maybe it'd be a not-for-profit that gives back millions to its members and community. The kind of place where the CEO is just as accessible as any other team member. 
a revolutionary partnership forged in your neighborhood and still standing strong after nearly a century. That's American Heritage Credit Union. Start your own financial revolution today. Hey, thanks everybody for tuning in today. Even during these incredibly challenging times, cancer doesn't stop. Please join Pause for the Cause this month. No matter what activity, whether you're walking your dog, snuggling with your cat, or just enjoying a day with your family and your pets, you will be making a difference in the lives of countless patients at Fox Chase. Stay safe and stay well. Thanks everyone for participating in our 2020 Pause for the Cause Pup Rally. I look forward to seeing you all virtually and knowing that all of you are participating from all around the globe in our event. Get your friends, get your relatives, put teams together, get your cats and dogs, and maybe other pets as well. And let's all work together to raise funds for cancer research at Fox Chase Cancer Center. Go to foxchase.org backslash pause to register. We look forward to seeing you. Walk on. <laughs> <laughs>